Here we have a 2011 BMW 118D Sport. It's on 64,647 miles. One or two light marks on the bumpers. Uh, got about four light wheel refurbs. Uh, other than that, nice clean car is this. Uh, so just starting down this offside front wing. Looking down the side, all looks nice and original. Uh, we do have a few chips just the front wing edge there, as you can see. And we've just got a problem with the bumper fitting up to the wing there as well. Down this front alloy, we've got some light curb damage just there, as you can see. And we've got a decent bit of tread on that front tyre as well. Just coming down the side of the car, we've got the carbon fibre mirror covers there. And onto this front door, one or two light marks around the handle there, but I think that would polish off. Just up at the air post, we've got some marks just on the air post trim there, as you can see, and just on the mirror. And the light scuff just on the air post there as well, with a chip in the paint. Just coming onto the quarter panel, all looks nice on the quarter panel, one or two light marks, which would polish out. And down its rear alloy, we've got some light curb damage just there. And just there, and we've got some pitting in the centre cap as well, with a decent bit of tread on that rear tyre. Just coming onto the rear bumper, it's just not fitting just right there as you can see, and we've just got a couple of chips in the paintwork there as well. Just coming round the bumper corner, we've got a chip just down there, and one or two marks just on that rear bumper. One or two light scuffs just across the top of the rear bumper there, but I think they would polish out with just a couple of bits of touch up as well. Up at the badge, we've got some pitting areas on the badge there as well. Uh, just coming down to the near side, all looks nice and original down the near side, everything lines up. Uh, one or two light marks in the paintwork, again just a little bit of touch up. Uh, I think that would polish up nicely. And down its rear wheel we've got some curb damage just there and it's just caught the tyre a little bit as well. Uh, with some pitting on the centre cap also. Just coming down to the front door we've got some marks around the handle again which would polish out. And onto the front wing, front wing looks fine. Again, we've got the same problem with the bumper to the wing on this side. Uh, looks like an easy fix does that. And down at this front alloy, we've got some light curb damage again on that alloy. And we've got a decent bit of tread on that front tyre as well. Just coming around the front end, we've got the usual stone chips to the front end, as you would expect with the mileage. And we've got a slight mark just there as well, which would touch up. Up at the bonnet, we've got some stone chips to the front edge of the bonnet there, all to be expected with the mileage. And up at the windscreen, we've got a couple of chips just there, um, with them probably being the worst ones, other than that, some very light chips around. It's had the carbon fibre, what looks like a roof wrap on this. Uh, it looks like a decent job. Just coming into the boot, looks nice and clean and tidy in there, not too much damage at all. Uh, maybe one or two marks just on the rear trim there. Other than that, we'll clean up nicely. And it looks like we've got all the first aid kit and the tools and the battery in there as well. So just coming into the back, no permanent damage that I can see to the seats, it will clean up nice, will this? And we've just got some slight marks just on the side trim there as you can see. Back of the seats, one or two very light scuffs, uh, but that will clean up nicely. And the same on the driver's seat also. Just coming into the front, door trim seem fine, one or two light marks just on the lower part there. Uh, other than that, will clean up nice. Like I say, we've got the marks on the air post just running down there. Uh, the front seat seems fine, we've got some slight wear just to the bolster on the side and one or two light creases just on the lower part there. Other than that, no permanent damage that I can see to the dash. Uh, it looks like it will clean up like a nice car will this inside. I mean, started it up, can just confirm the mileage there at 64,647 miles. Looks like we have a problem with the auto start stop there, and we've also got the tyre pressure warning light coming up. Other than that, no warning lights. We've got the cigarette light to missing just there. We've got the locking wheel nut key in there. Uh, like I say, it will clean up nice inside will this. No permanent damage that I can see. Uh, maybe a light stain in the seat just there, but I think that will clean up nice. 